Hi, I'm Dr. Russell Osgathorpe, and I'm so thrilled to talk with you about HealthSpan. Just to be clear, HealthSpan is not the same thing as lifespan. Lifespan is the number of years we live, whereas HealthSpan is the number of years we live healthy. Now, I know that many of you have seen this graph several times, but it is so important to our understanding of the MetaPower system that I'm going to go into greater detail than we ever have before. Because if you understand this graph, you'll take MetaPower the rest of your life and be able to share it more effectively with others. If we consider our lifespan, the number of years we are alive, on the horizontal axis here, and our health span, the quality of our cognitive and physical performance on the vertical axis here, we can draw a curve that represents what naturally happens to our health span as we age, shown here in gray. However, the reality is we live in an incredible time where medicine and science can extend our lives. This dark blue line represents what happens when we use the best of medicine to try and manage issues related to a poor lifestyle. As these interventions improve our numbers, we can gain a modest amount of health span and lifespan. But what is staggering to me is how little benefit is derived from decades of this type of management. Look how close that blue line is to the gray line. It's incredibly minimal. As we near the end of our life on the blue line, you can see how through heroic use of life-extending medical technology, we can extend an individual's lifespan by a few years. But look at the quality of life that person is experiencing. Our lives might be extended by these heroic medical efforts, but one could argue that they are not enriched. Finally, let's look at the orange line. This is more typical for master athletes and people stacking healthy lifestyle habits consistently throughout their lives. What is most impressive about this group of people is that health span and lifespan can both be significantly improved. People who optimize their metabolism through daily exercise, diet, relationships, stress management can not only potentially live longer, but add life to those years. Here's my dream, my why for my health span. Well into my 90s, I want to be able to spend a day, many days, out fly fishing with my posterity. I'd be able, on any of those days, to back my truck down the ramp, unload my drift boat, launch that boat, and then row that boat myself all day long. Watch my kids and posterity catch boatloads of fish. And then at the end of my life, I'd go home from a day of fishing, enjoy dinner with my family, and peacefully pass away in my sleep. That would be a health span that matches or equals my lifespan. Let me show you how that works. Let's assume that here on the vertical axis, we have 100% quality of cognitive and physical health during young adulthood. Now let's draw a line across this chart at 50% function. This is the stage of physical and cognitive health span where we are still capable of caring for ourselves, still living independently. We might not be running a 10 minute mile anymore, but we are probably able to walk a brisk 15 minute mile without difficulty with our kids or grandkids. Said differently, above this line, you can still do the things you want to do, although you might notice slight declines in your performance as you age closer to that 50% line. Below this line, living independently becomes more difficult due to cognitive decline or having enough physical strength and stamina to perform our daily activities. Now, if we continue that line at 50% function across the chart, Look at where it intersects the blue line versus the orange line. This is what you need to understand. Look at what you can gain when you optimize your metabolism. Look at those years. But more importantly, look at the life that is added to those years. We can't always have a health span that lines up perfectly with lifespan, but we can certainly do better. Our lifestyle choices can extend our health span. Full stop. When we combine a mindful and consistent approach to our diet, movement, stress management, relationships, we can maximize all the efforts we make in improving our lifestyle and then reap the benefits for all of our years to come. Here's the even better news. It does not matter where you are on the curve or how old you are when you start. Any lasting efforts made by an individual to make improvements in their lifestyle will reap tremendous benefits 
for years to come.